This is Jason Spangler with Wagner Meters and in the process of compiling a, an article that we're getting ready to put out called Five Myths in Concrete Moisture Testing, there were a couple of myths that really stood out to me. One of them is, if the concrete's old, it's got to be dry. Well, when you really look at it, a lot of older slabs on grade were actually constructed without any kind of vapor retarder. And if they did have a vapor retarder, a lot of times what's been found is that the vapor retarders used were actually very thin and they've degraded to a point that they're not effective in preventing moisture from coming from the soil or any of the gravel below the slab. So what we end up with is you end up with a slab that yes, it may be 20 or 30 years old, but because it does not have an intact vapor retarder, it really is extremely wet. The second point that I've actually came across dealt with elevated slabs. And a lot of people that I hear or that I talk to, they'll talk about the fact that with elevated slabs, new or old, they have less of an inkling to actually test them because of the fact there is no ability for any kind of moisture to be integrated from the slab or in the case of below grade slabs from the uh, subsoil. And I find that to be very interesting because some of the worst failures that I've seen have been slabs that were old and slabs that were elevated that once they did the demo on the existing floor that was there, it was recognized when they did the testing that it had an extremely high level of moisture to reapply today's products. So those are just two real quick ones. This is Jason Spangler signing off.